This isn't necessarily a part two to my previous video on how to fix the update, but if you seem to have dropped yourself into the scenario without intending to, if you're trying to download this update, it just simply doesn't want to download, it'll spit out some error. So what you're going to do is going to go to the Microsoft catalog for the updates, go specifically to the latest one, I will link this in the description so you don't have to type it in, and you're just going to download the same one. Okay, now you'll just run it. It's like an executable. And you'll hit yes. Close that, close that. Okay. Again, your mileage may vary depending on the speed of your component, so it may take longer than that. I have a pretty fast computer, so it only takes a couple minutes, but for you, it might take an hour or two. It's only 200 megs, so it shouldn't take too, too long. Okay, so once that downloads, we're gonna hit restart. Let it do its thing. Okay, so I know that this screen shows that we don't have the update, but we're just gonna hit download anyways. Okay, so once it downloads the install like a normal Windows update, you should be good to go. Just give it one more update check one more time, and we're all good.